The complete one hour training guide for the Canon EOS digital SLR camera is available to download now in high definition from learncamera.com. Whilst most photographers will want to import and edit their photographs before printing anything out, it is sometimes useful to be able to take advantage of the ability to print direct from the camera. A good example might be a party where casual pictures can be taken, printed and shared with everyone at the time rather than after the event. We begin by connecting the camera to any PictBridge compatible printer. For this demonstration I am using a fairly entry level Canon IP3600 printer which has a USB socket on the front. The camera shipped with the correct cable to allow us to do this. When we turn on the camera it operates in exactly the same way and will let us continue to take pictures. Now when we use the preview and playback we are given the option to print the image directly from the camera. Press the set button once to configure the printing options. We have control over quite a few options. Firstly we can adjust the colour profiles, choosing between on, off, vivid and noise reduction. We can add photo information for reference purposes. We can choose the number of copies to print. I really like the powerful trim features. We can frame in landscape or portrait. Using the plus and minus keys we can enlarge or reduce the crop size. Finally we can rotate a crooked picture to straighten it up. Press set to confirm. Finally we have control over the paper and quality settings. We can choose between all the printed supported media types. Next depending on the type of media we can select the print type. Finally we can change the page layout accordingly. Before printing we can review the options selected the thumbnail shows the image with a green box denoted in the area for printing if being cropped out. Below this we can see the paper size, print quality and page layout. When we are ready we simply press the print button once. As you can see the camera and printer do a pretty good job. Let's quickly take a look at the other way to print directly. Press the menu button once, select the playback menu 1 and select print order. Next we choose select image using the left and right arrow keys to locate the image we wish to print then using the up and down arrows we can specify the number of copies required. This tallies to the right hand side the total number of prints currently in the queue. Once we have selected the images for printing press the menu button once to return. Selecting all images, we can mark or clear all images for printing. Setup allows us to set up exactly how we want these images printed. We can specify if we want full prints and or little index thumbs. We can also add date and file number for referencing purposes once printed. When ready, we press the print button. From here, we can specify the paper size, print quality and layout. When ready we select OK to print.